Welcome back, guys. Thank you so much for joining my channel. Um, if you're an Odie but a goodie, thank you again for support. If you are new, I'm viewing or coming across my video, please like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you will not miss out on any um up new new content that I'm uploading for either home decor, fashion, or what have you. Um, but today's video, I am bringing you some items from AliExpress and also from DH Gates. I know you guys did not think that I was going to forget about my little mama. Yes, my little mama. She is going to be a little diva in training. She is 18 months and she is going to be so much like her mother. I got a couple items from AliExpress. As always, I will leave the um, seller's contact information in the description box. Hopefully the link does not get taken down. Um, guys, let me know if you rather for like to be in the box or if you just want to email it. I haven't had any issues where um, YouTube has taken down any of my videos um, for leaving the seller's information in there. I do see that some sellers, um, not sellers, some YouTubers leave that information um, in the description box, maybe because I'm still small, but it works for me instead of having 50 million um, emails about it because I think it's just easier in the description box. But if it comes to an issue where they're shutting down my videos, I'm gonna have to think about something um, new for you all to to view or explore as we say so these are a couple of dupes that I've came across for myself and also for my little mama so the first up I got her this gorgeous little Hermes inspired dupe little purse for a little me this beauty was $8.96 it is gorgeous. It is small just for a little little diva. It is so gorgeous. It has her little the little claps on it. Um, it opens up when she gets a little bit older, she'll be able to put like some lip gloss in it and maybe some candy or something. Um, it's just really bite sized and just so cute. Um, <laughs> I wanted her to get get her one of these because you know I got my um my Hermes, uh, Hermes pocketbook. So I wanted her to have one to kind of match mommy. It's a different color, but I wanted it in black. They have like another like burgundy looking color, but she doesn't have a lot of burgundy stuff. So, um, and it's so cute when she tries it on. I'm gonna show a video of her um, walking here with it on and she knows how to hold it and everything. It is so cute. The chain is super long. Um, I kind of tied it in a knot so she can have it around her, but it is super long, um, for a little kid, but this is something that you can adjust, um, to your liking, um, for your, for your little one. And it has like little clips on it. Um, but this is just the cutest little thing that I seen. Um, and I just had to get her one. I had, I had to get it because, um, when I have my purse on, she's always like, mm, mm, like it's mine, it's mine. So it was about time for her to get her little collection going. When she gets older, I keep telling my husband that it's going to be bad. She has all brothers and it's just going to be bad. Yes, yeah, she's spoiled rotten and, you know, I might as well start it right. This is my only daughter, so I might as well start it right. But isn't that just the cutest little thing that you've seen? I mean, I haven't seen too many little purses like this. It is gore. It is so cute for a little diva. The next item that I got, I got for her, which I think was a really, really good replica or dupe, however you your terminology for it, for a little one. I think this one was a really good, um, good buy for the price. I got her a little Chanel bag. Yes, can you see this? Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous. Can you can you just imagine my little mama wearing this? It is gorgeous. It is so gorgeous. Like both of these are just gorgeous. Can you see that? Now look at the detail. This one has impeccable detail. If you can see, I'm trying not to get the light. You can see, back it up some, that it does have the Chanel print right here where the buttons is. And when you open it up, it also has the Chanel 
Can you see it? Right here. And I still have like the little plat the little stuff in here for her because she doesn't have nothing to put in it, to be honest. It, it does also have a very, very long chain. It is made of uh was it pew leather? Um it has a little pocket in it and it's red in the inside. They come in three different colors, pink, red, um, and black. I'm not sure if they had a beige, I can't remember, but if you have a little one that you want to do like mini knees with, this, is, I mean, it's so soft, it is so cute. Um, and for the price, and for the, the quality and the price, I could not beat it. I was just like, this is gonna be something that I'm going to add for her little co collection, her start off. And I like that since she's so small, I, I mean, I kind of, I don't know if you've just seen it. I just tucked the, I tucked the, the, the strapping in, inside because she's small and she can't really hold her purse. But I like how you can adjust it to your liking and it could just, you know, go inside the purse and then... If you wanted a two strand, you could have a two strand, you know, you could have a two strand, you know, for your, for your little one, or you could just keep it as one right now. I'm just going to keep it as one so she can get used to having something on her arm. Um, but she's adapting to that quite well herself when she's dragging around my, my bag. Um, but I just thought. I will bring something a little different. I don't see a lot of videos um, catering to um, our children. And I do apologize to her in the background. She's playing with her brother, so she's screaming. It seemed like, as usual, every time I start videoing, so I do apologize. But I just wanted to bring some new content because I haven't seen, like, little reviews on children's dupes, you know? Um, I think sometimes they're really a good dupe for a child. is hard to find. So when I came across this, I was like, oh yeah, I got to jump on it. I'm going to also get her one in black. I'm going to try to get a different style. I think I want the one with the Chanel with the had like the little rolls on it, but I have to do a little bit more hunting for it. Like always, I will have the description in the description box of the seller if you're interested. Okay, so my next item I got from DH Gate. I am so 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 happy for this because I have seen this on celebrities' feet like last year, year before last. It's it looks it's a little bit old, but it's gonna be it's new to me. And I still love it, I still like it. And um needless to say, I'm trying to get my feet ready for the summer because the warmer warmer weather is coming, um, if we like it or not. So I got, and I hope I do not pronounce the name wrong, and I know I probably will, so I do apologize. But I got a Louis Vuitton, look at this, Louis Vuitton, what's in the box, what's in the box, what's in the box? It came, um, I got this off a of seller in a DH gate, it came in the box, I asked for the box, and it came in the original box. It also had a little bag, that was surprising to me, um, and then I got the bag also with it. So I'll hold on to this and, 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 and um, put it up somewhere. It, I was really surprised about that. It also has like the receipt that you'll see um, in some, some of the um, higher quality or higher price items. It has like the little invoice um, receipt for, you know, receipt for, for it. And... When you buy these, this this shoe, I want to say, if, oh my God, if correct me if I'm wrong, I want to say they were like five hundred dollars, I believe, for these slides. Um, you know, I will leave if I'm wrong. I believe the correct price for it, but it comes with a wrapping and it has a little dust bag with it with the little drawstring which I like I have Louis Vuitton on it and <laughs> let me take the plastic off voila voila 
Now, I believe it's called, is it Donna Bam or something like that? Um, but these are gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that. Smells just like leather. It is leather. It's cowed hot leather. It has a little buckle on it. I did it in pink. Um, I would say that is true to size. I am I'm, I'm 5'11", so I have big feet. Sorry. I wish it was smaller, but they're not. I ordered a, uh, a 44... 44 European um and it's just is is just is just right it's just right I could have went with like a 45 but when I tried these on um to be honest they're slippery I I, I would say this like this part I, I I wouldn't have thought that it was but it is slippery like when you when you put your foot in it it's good quality but it does slip a little bit so I think if I would have got an like a uh, inch bigger I, I'd have been going going like going like that and I don't think that's gonna be very comfortable and it's very very slick right here if you can hear that it's very very smooth so you're gonna have to if you decide to get these shoes kind of scuff them up a little bit well I guess when you wear them they will get scuffed up themselves um just so you won't bust your ass I'm sorry but you you might <laughs> if you don't do it beforehand you will if you go on something like some slick floor you're going you're just get prepared for it because it's not if when is it is going to happen so i would recommend before you go on some really smooth surfaces kind of scrape your foot a little bit at the bottom just to give it a little bit of a roughness at the bottom because you're going down but you're going down so i'm gonna forewarn you because when i tried these on in my house on my hardwood floors i'm walking around thinking i'm cute and Whoop, whoop. I was I was going down but um anyway <laughs> so you can see here it does have the Louis V you can't really I'm so sorry let's see it has a Louis V stamping can you see that there we go let's get right there and it also has it on the heel um and it has you know the print in the inside of it one thing I have noticed um, with the last three dupes that I got, and this just could just be me, with my um, pochette motifs, and um, I'm looking at this pair of sh this shoes, the leather, the leather um, is really good leather. And you can tell because you know how, like right here is dark, and they all have that dark print. Um, I'm, I'm going to have to see if I can let show y'all the difference. Hold on. Every, every um, print could be a little bit different due to uh, the quality of it. Even authentic can be the, the, the print can be a lighter, could be darker. Um, but I just wanted to show you how closely they are lining up together as far as the leather in the coloration. Do you see the coloration in um, the Louis V, the print? They are almost identical to each other. And I find that really good. Even when I have the belt strap together. Now this is the belt strap that I got from the seller off of um, Juanello. But do you see the print? How close they are to identical to each other? And I kind of peeped that out and I really like that I was able to find really good dupes um, to kind of match each other because when you're putting, when you're, you know, you got people who look at you that you don't even think that's looking at you and looking at what you got on and how you rocking it. You know, you'd be, you'd be really surprised who's watching you. Um, but I like how they are really good dupes. They're really good quality um, because a lot of them will be a little bit darker, a little bit lighter. or you, I mean, you could just tell the difference. And, if, you know, you can see the difference between these two. And they are really almost right on when it comes to the leather and the coloration of that leather but i just wanted to show you like sometimes again you know when you get a really good quality 
and we're there i order from two different sellers from two different sites um it, it all sometimes can work out like i was saying in my last video so i just wanted to show you that i did get a pair that the matching pair um to this and i know when i looked online um on the the louis vuitton site they don't even carry the the I want to say the is it the Demir print? They don't even carry the Demir print in this style shoe. Now they carry it in um I don't have a brain freeze. And the other print, the checker, the I can't even think of the name of it right now, and I do apologize. The white and uh gray checkered print. Um they carry it in that print and it's pink and it has, you know, the checker print here. But I didn't see it in this print on the site. And I'll show you a picture um, here so you can see how, how alike they really are. But again, I'm trying to get my feet ready <laughs> for summer. I have been eyeballing this. And to be honest, the reason why I didn't get it earlier because girl, child, again, I got big feet. It's hard. It's hard to find shoes in a size 10 or 11. Sometimes 12s if you just want to, you know, have that comfort level. It, it, it's hard. And then you got you competing with everybody these days. So it's, it, 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 it's hard for a sister. It's hard. You know, they want your models to be 5'11 and taller. But they, they know by a woman being so tall, she going to have big feet. And you can get a size, you can't, you, you can have 50 million nines and fives and sevens, but they only have like two tens and two elevens. Who does that? Who do, so it's like me and another woman just fighting over the same shoe. That ain't right. That ain't right. They gotta, they gotta do better. You just gotta do better than that. But anyways, <laughs> again, another rant. Sorry. But... I am so happy, again, that I came across this. Um, my feet's not done, so I'm not showing him my feet. But I'll be going next week to get my pedicure. And like I said, I'll be ready. Kids going on spring break soon. And yes, I'm going to be ready. Please, if you like and you subscribe, if you like my videos, please subscribe to my videos. I really do appreciate all of you, all your comments. This has, been, again, has been wonderful. Um, I will try to keep it up. Please comment if you'd like to see some more of my DUIs. I will be doing some DUIs. Um, sometimes I get conflicted because I don't know if people really like my DUIs or they more like my Bougie on a Budget series. So um, give me some ideas um, for some content. Um, I did have some stuff for um, my male audience, but my shipment got canceled it didn't get i had got some um tims for my husband because he's a tim wearer and i wanted to review that um but it, it didn't pass through custom and they canceled it so now i have to find something else and i'm looking for waiting for his other two items to come in so hopefully we won't have any problems through customs for that but as always thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you uh for your time your your support um, and I will see you guys on the next series. I will try again, uh, uh, upload content either every Wednesday and thir or Thursday. So again, thank you so much. Please enjoy this little video of my little mama rocking her bag. Um, bye guys. See you later. Mook, Mook, look, come here. Where you going, Mook? Mook, Mook, let me see your purse. See Asia, let me see your purse. Can I see your purse? Let me see your purse, Asia. Is that your purse? <laughs>